Accessibility. Accessibility. Welcome to Nashville, Tennessee, along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sobolski. The Ducks are in the driver's seat and can really put the squeeze here tonight with a win. Each step you can take along the way is another nail in the coffin. They want to put one more in tonight. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening faceoff. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Moussa Tawa, he scores! The captain leading by example. Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. The Ducks have quickly found a way to silence this home crowd here, Ray. People are going to come in from the parking lot and be shocked that it's already 1-0. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Excellent stick work on the play. Here's a short pass to Burns. On the attack along the boards. A chance in front, and they can't convert to the play. Great poise here as he gets it back. Puck picked up by Kunin. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Ross got it along the boards. Quick feed to Tatar. Scores! A couple goals in right around a minute and 50 seconds. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Man, these burn the coaching staff. When they see a player get open in the high slot, the first thing they're going to look for is who's supposed to be standing near him. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The Ducks have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. The Predators played along the wing. The Ducks look to start the transition game. Was got it across the line. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Nashville's got it along the wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Shot takes it right in the chest. And there's the whistle giving him a chance to exhale. Feeds the puck over to Hurdle. Feeds it to Arvidsson. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Taken along the wall by Juice. Dropped him in the open ice. Stops him cold. Quick pass to Hole. Handles the puck. The Ducks take it across the blue line. Nothing doing on that. Makes his presence known on the ice. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Tatar's playoffs have been almost dreamlike. He's among the league leaders in goals this playoff season. Anaheim's up here in the first, and they could easily be up by more based on what they've done offensively. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. Nashville's gained possession along the boards. Right up the gut, here they go. 
Favreau's carrying it ahead. Taken by Goudreau. And that goes off the iron and stays out. Nashville's players are frustrated as they have a really good scoring chance, but it hits the post and doesn't close the gap. Gibson's simply going to slow it down here, Ray. Do you like the strategy? I do, but he hasn't touched the puck much this period, James, so you get to handle it a little bit here and maybe a little nervous, so you jump on it and get to reset. There's the horn concluding the first 20 minutes. See a few fans already jumping the gun there, trying to beat some of the lineups in the concessions and the washrooms. The Ducks backed up all that talk from the morning skate. They wanted to get off to a good start. They certainly have done just that, leading by a pair of goals. We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. Anaheim's had outstanding stick positioning. Coaches will love to show this in the video tomorrow. The Predators get a hold of the puck along the boards. The Ducks take over on possession. Stopped by the goaltender. Coonan stick handling in his own zone. Takes the pass. Moves it quickly over to Coonan. And that's blocked. Gibson's got the puck. going to go for the whistle here. He hasn't had a lot to do this period, but he's been excellent and has been able to control the pace of play. The Ducks have looked good offensively tonight, generating all sorts of opportunities. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Anaheim's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides it over with pace to walk. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Receives the pass. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Anaheim's got a hold of it against the wall. The Ducks gain possession in their own end. Picked up along the boards by Fowler. Sends a pass over. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Moves it to Goudreau. Moves the puck. Anaheim's got control of it now from their own end. Puck scooped up by Yarncroft. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. The Ducks gain control of the puck against the wall. Silverberg's got it through the neutral zone. Here's a blast! Huge stop by Fleury. Good technique as the puck is over to the corner out of the way. From one point man to another. Nothing doing! Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if he can't get the puck at the goaltender. Knocked around, but keeps it going. And that one's broken up. The Ducks with a total team effort to this point as they lead comfortably here in the second. Nashville's got a hold of the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. They go on the attack from the left side. To his teammate, he scores! Well, when it rains, it pours. And they are just coming out in buckets right now as they get three straight. Really a dominating performance. I like the skill here, James, to make the pass and then to receive it, shoot it all in one motion. The Ducks are starting to make people lose track of just how wide this lead is now. Busiest guy in the rink is the guy changing the numbers on the clock. Man, they are awesome tonight. There's the horn ending period number two. I'm not sure they wanted it to end. Good old days of hockey are back. This is your 
Don't go anywhere. The third period is just moments away. been a dominant force offensively plenty of quality scoring opportunities and they lead it big time early in the third puck is dropped and play resumes into the offensive end now he grabs the puck here at the point moves it around along the half wall here he is wrists it on net denies him in close nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter picked up along the wall by Fowler Steps into the offensive end. Sends it over. And that slides right out to center ice. Scooped up along the wall by Burns. The Predators have it against the wall. The Ducks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Slides it across and puts it off the crossbar. Had the goalie beat up high, but not the bar. Silverberg's production really comes as no surprise. He's among one of the league leaders in points in the postseason. We're still in the early stages of this period. 5-1 is where we sit to this point. Nice job tying up his opponent. Here's a short pass to Yossi. Takes the feed. Sends it out right in front. And a beautiful save by the goaltender. Gibson's had a relatively easy night. He hasn't faced many shots, and they've got a nice, comfortable lead. Denies him! He got all of it! And now he tries to get it across to Yarncroft. Oh, and another big stop! Puck battle along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. The Ducks have it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Jones. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Silverberg's skills are evident, but what I like, James, is how he sees the ice so well. Everybody's a dangerous player when he's got the puck. Takes the feed. The Ducks move it in. Stays with it. Makes the save. Right in the low slot. And he slides it quickly to Butcher. Passes right to the front. Here's a shot. And that one's turned away. And he elects to play the puck. The Ducks gain control of it. And now it's grabbed by Silverberg. No, oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Slides the puck over. Dumps it in. Anaheim's got the puck along the boards. The Predators go to work on offense. Denied by the goaltender. Coming up on the final minute of regulation time. That's it. There's the final horn to close this one up. They may not be talking about it in the room, but you know we are having that conversation, and fans as well thinking sweep now, Ray. Well, 3-0, the series totally in hand. It's only happened a few times that someone has been able to come all the way back from down 3-0. Another reason why we love playoff hockey. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Good night.